Canada is home to almost 50 national parks and reserves, covering all five of the country's biomes. Tundra is the second largest of these biomes and covers the northernmost extent of the country. Despite being Canada's most inhospitable region, with by far the lowest temperatures and the lowest levels of precipitation, the tundra is home to some of the country's most beloved animals. Found to the west on the Alaskan border, Kluwani National Park is one of the country's 11 natural UNESCO World Heritage Sites and sits partially in our next biome. Canada's boreal forest is marginally larger and features the most natural UNESCO sites at six. This biome exhibits significantly more vegetation than the tundra, being home to some of the country's most spectacular forests, but still ranks second lowest in species richness across all four terrestrial vertebrate groups. Birds here include the colourful spruce grouse and the boreal chickadee, and this biome even has its very own frog. In the east, Newfoundland hosts two natural UNESCO sites, including Gros Morn National Park on the island's northwest coast. Beneath the boreal forest lie the remaining three biomes, one of which exhibits the highest average elevation. The temperate conifer forests here are home to some of Canada's most accessible wildlife, found in a handful of national parks, collectively referred to as the Canadian Rocky Mountain Parks, which are blessed with the region's high density of mammal species. British Columbia is thought to be home to over 120,000 black bears alone, and the coastline of the province also boasts the country's highest levels of precipitation, gifting British Columbia a natural gem known as the Great Bear Rainforest. To the east of this region sit Canada's temperate grasslands, and of the region's two national parks, Grasslands National Park is, unsurprisingly, the best example of this habitat. This biome exhibits the highest average bird species richness in Canada, with several birds of prey making use of the wide open grasslands, alongside other species. Although the Great White North is not exactly famous for its reptiles, among other species the prairie rattlesnake is found here, preying on the region's small mammals. Continuing eastward, our last biome sits in the far southeast of the country. Canada's temperate broadleaf and mixed forests features 12 national parks, and a higher density of reptile species than any other Canadian biome. Its levels of species richness are facilitated by warmer temperatures and higher levels of precipitation than the north and centre of the country. These forests are home to a small collection of colourful salamander species, a particularly famous bird named the Blue Jay, and more human beings than any other Canadian biome.